Last time on Safari Zone, we were introduced to the 20 contestants, and they were sorted into four teams based around the zone. Team Lake, Team Mountain, Team Plain, and Team Jungle. With the first eviction coming up, who will show their true colors, who will break down, and who will be going home? Find out this episode of Safari Zone! Man, that was some party! Oh god, I've got a headache. Hey, girls, can someone get me something to eat and drink? Chop, chop! We ain't got no food. Yes, turns out they do not supply us with nourishment along with the shelter. Then how the heck are we supposed to not starve? That party was tight, man. You ladies sure know how to have a good time. Beautifly, get us some food. <laughs> I just partied? I need a good few hours before the drugs wear off. I can't help anyone, not even myself. Ugh, Purloin. What's up, Rosalia? What did you do to us? Where is our food? I bet you sabotaged us and hid all the food we had near us. Um, no. Typhlosion told us that we needed to find our own food. Since I'm a nice person, I'll go find some nearby. What a traitor, trying to trick us with her lies. Come on! What kind of place is this? Expecting us to brave the harsh wilderness without any sort of weapon? Barbaric. At least I know that Beautifly, Clefairy, and Gotharita have my back. Purloin is still trying to betray us. I know it. I'll expose her for the evil she is. Combuskin keeps insisting he's the leader of the team. What crap? He's a hot-headed idiot. In fact, all the guys on this team are loud, obnoxious jerks. Come on now! Sure, Combuskin and Charmeleon are a bit extreme, but they are really driven to win. As long as we help, we'll never lose! That's true. And hey, even if we did lose, we always have a pawn on our team. Stop! He's a Pokemon like you and me! Maybe he's a little goofy, but he has a certain charm. Ew! Don't tell me you like him! Food's ready! Get it while it's hot! Come on, let's go eat. Togetic? Get up, Squirt! Time to eat! Combuskin wants everyone to be at the top of their game because if we lose, you'll be paying for it. And trust me, I won't be too hurt if you're booted. Okay, okay, I'm... I'm going. I, I can't believe Togetic just said that! I mean, yeah, she didn't say I was her ideal guy, but... But she said I was charming. Could she... Could she actually... Like me? Oh my gosh, I might get a real friend! Woo! You just met him. No need to fall head over heels. Yeah, it could really hurt your chances of winning the game. You barely know this guy. I don't care! He saved my life, and the way he looks at me, I can just tell he feels the same way I feel about him. I think it's true love. That's ridiculous! You need to keep a leveled head and stay cool. If it's meant to be, then it'd be pretty obvious. Right now, not so much. Hey girls, Pikachu and me just got back from a food run. It's not a lot, but enough for the morning. Help yourself when you get the chance. Don't worry, Eevee. We've got your back no matter what you do. Just do be careful with yourself. Eevee's on my team and a really sweet girl. However, she's being terribly foolish. I'm sure Pikachu's a great guy, but they literally met a day ago. If those two aren't careful with how they act, it could ruin both their chances of moving forward in this game. I may want to win, but we are a unit. We need to work together. So, why did you join this game if you aren't into the physical challenges? Well, what I lack in strength I make up for in brains. I'm sure I could outsmart most Pokemon here. And as long as I don't make myself a threat, I assure myself a long-lasting game. How are you so sure you're smarter than someone like me? You're right. I guess I'll just have to get you voted out. <laughs> 
<laughs> Get your lazy butts up. We have food to find. No one eats unless they find it themselves. No stragglers allowed. Don't worry, man. I'll get enough food for the both of us. Staravia is a really awesome guy. He's really easy to talk to and be around. He never makes me feel insecure or inferior. In fact, around him, I feel perfect with who I am. Where the heck is that villain with our breakfast? Shit, I'm pretty sure that was laced with something. I'm seeing like four of each of you guys. I managed to find a few berries in a bush nearby. I think there were more, but I decided it'd be best to bring these back first. Ugh, these things look tainted! Trying to poison us? How dare you! Why did you just do that? I thought you wanted food! Ugh! That's right, run away like the villain you are! What a monster. That was effed up. Hello teams, and welcome to day two of Safari Zone. Today, we will be having our second challenge and first elimination. So, by the end of tonight, one of you will be leaving this competition. Now, I'm sure you're all aware of your eating situations. Luckily, this land is full of berries and other treats. Today's challenge is a berry hunt. You will search the zone for five types of berries, all which differ in values. These are Orin berries, worth 10 points each, Rost berries, worth 25 points, Lum berries, worth 50 points, Cherry berries, worth 100 points, and Citrus berries, worth a whopping 500 points. The team with the highest points at the end of the challenge will not only receive immunity, but they will also receive an additional mountain of berries as a reward. However, the team with the lowest points will be sending someone home tonight. So get ready, get set, go! Team Mountain! Get back here, idiots! I'm in charge! No way they are getting the lead on us! The only way to secure victory is to split up. So Meryl and Petalil, head west into the jungle. Make sure you find the mossy areas, because they have way more berries. Got it! Let's go, Petalil! Pikachu, Eevee, you two head to the southern area of the jungle. I think there might be some rare berries around there, but be careful. It's pretty wild. Um, I'm gonna head to the northern jungle, because I might have seen a citrus barrier or two. Wish me luck. Heracross, wait! Well, uh, we better get going. It's gonna be a long day, huh? <laughs> oh boy. Alrighty, ladies, I say we all work together. So, I'll tell you what to do and you'll all do it, okay? I'm more of a yeller than a doer. Hey, I happen to know some good places to find berries. If you want, I can take you there. Nice try, dark type. I think I'll take my chances. Have fun being alone, loser. See ya, bitch. I must also pass. You know, because you're literally the worst. Sure. Okay. I'll just do it myself, I guess. Whatever. No big deal. I don't even care. I don't even- Stop talking to yourself, weirdo! <sighs> First ones! Eat my dust, bitches! Which way? Who cares? Woo! I'm going to clobber you two dumbasses! They sure do have a lot of energy. Yeah, but it's kind of a waste of time. Most berries are found at the top of trees, not at the roots. But how do we get up there? Don't worry, I got this. What do you think? That's great! I know, right? There's a bunch more up there. I'm gonna go get them. Perfect! I'll keep track of them, and together we might actually win this. I'm very lucky there are so few flying types in this competition. It's kind of perfect. I mean, it isn't noticeable enough to make me a target, but it's powerful enough to definitely keep me in this game. And if it helps keep Dwebble, there's nothing wrong with that, you know? Petalil, I found a bunch! Come on! Nice find, but how are we going to get up there? Don't worry, I'll just throw you up there. Just get on my head and- MOVE! Stupid girls! Wow, that was, uh, forceful. Duh! You don't win unless you take charge. Ain't no way I'm letting these two take my winnings. Now, Butterfree, get that fruit. Okay, you're the boss. That's right, I am. Now let's keep going. I can feel other berries nearby. Idiot. Winning takes dedication, strength, and lots of force. Hey, they never said I couldn't take others' berries or beat them up. 
I say, all's fair in winning and winning. <laughs> if they want it back, they can try and take it back. In the end, I'll come out on top. Oh my god, there are no berries anywhere! Man, I think we're in the wrong place to find berries. Wait, Clefairy, shut the fuck up for a minute. What's that over there in the grass? Oh my god, beautiful light. This is the- Oh! Hells yes! We're back in the game! Party! Man, that hit the spot. Now, where do we find those berries? You did not. I'm beginning to view this world as a literal hell. What? I was hungry. I'm about to smack a hoe. Roselia, do us all a huge favor and go kill yourself. Fine, lead yourselves, losers. Hey, Roselia, I managed to find a whole bunch of berries. We could actually win if Stop we- Stop trying to kill me, Ugh, you're literally the worst. It's okay, she's just a jerk. Don't listen to her. And stop talking to yourself, weirdo! Yeah, Rosalia is a huge asshole. That's fine. It's fine. All I know is that if we lose, when we lose, she's going home. Even if I'm the villain, she's still the biggest b b bad guy on the team. I hope that wasn't too mean. We should be close to some berries by now. This place is practically untouched by any Pokemon. Oh man, cherry berries! Wait here, I'll get them. Sure thing. Come on, Evie, say something to him. Why can't he just talk to me? Ugh! Carnivine! Who the... Oh my god! Oh my god, Pikachu! Carnivine! Ah! Evie? Evie, hold on, I'll save you. Electro Ball. Stay back, you. I'll, uh, I'll hurt you. Don't think I won't. Carnivine. Oh God. Carnivine. Are you okay? I hope he didn't hurt you. No, I'm fine. Thank you. You saved me again. I guess you're like my guardian angel, huh? Uh, hey, let's go get those berries. God damn it. He saved me twice, and yet can't manage to have a coherent conversation with me. Am I the problem, or is he? What am I supposed to be doing? I wish there was like a manual on dating guys or something. Oh, he's such an idiot. Cute. But still an idiot. Well, that looks like all the berries around here. This is perfect. All right, now let's get these back to Typhlosion. Good job, by the way. Thanks, man. It's no big deal. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> I'm going to deliver these to Typhlosion. Don't screw anything up, got it? Peace! I'll follow him and make sure he doesn't screw this up. Seriously, what a jerk. S so, Togetic, I was... Uh, I, I, I was just wondering if you, uh... Yeah? Well, you know, if, if, if you wanted to, uh... Pipsqueak, you're coming with me. Wait, but I... Okay, then. See ya. Okay, you're all set. You sure you're all right? Yep, I'll meet you back there, I guess. Ready, aim, fire! Ah! <clears throat> Thanks for the berries. See ya. Storavia. Oh my god, are, are, are you okay? I'm fine. Ugh. I just lost all the berries. Forget about that. I'll get you back to camp. Don't worry about anything. I'm here. Oh no, did I hurt the poor bird? Big deal. He wants to win? He'll have to fight me for it. <laughs> and I'm no pushover. I'm here to win, baby! Even if I have to beat every other competitor to a bloody pulp. Okay, everyone. I'll call each team up one by one and I'll tally up the points. The team with the most points earns a pile of berries for their camp. However, the team with the least points has to send someone home. Without further ado, team playing is first. You ready? Here we go. 23 Orin, 4 Rost, and 2 Lumberries gives you quite the assortment. However, your penalty is 100 points, which leaves you with an impressive 330 points. That'll be tough to beat, but next up is Team Mountain. 330? What were you guys even doing? 
following you. You are the leader, after all. Ugh, losers, the bunch of you! Follow me, chumps! Well, well, if it isn't my generous friends. Thanks for the berries, by the way. Couldn't have done it without you. We'll see who's laughing when you lose. Okay, <laughs> whatever you say. <laughs> Jerk. Will Team Mountain get more than 330 points? If not, you might be sending someone home. Ooh, 14 Orin, 2 Rost, and 1 Cherry. Even without a penalty, this is only 290 points. Sorry guys, looks like you didn't beat Team Plane. Morons, the lot of you! I'm, I'm sorry everyone, this is my fault. Hold on, I have one more berry. A Lumberry? That's 50 points, which brings your total score up to 340 points. Congrats, you guys are in first. Next is Team Jungle. At least someone's contributing! Twubble, where did you- I kept one with me in case I got hungry later, but this seemed more important. Besides, I couldn't let you take the heat. Thanks. Will home advantage play a part for you guys? 340 is the score to beat. 8 Orin, 1 Cherry and 1 Citrus. Jeez, you guys sure missed a bunch of berries, but you have a total of 660 points. Good job! Next time though, let's try and get some more. Where did that citrus berry come from? Took me a while to locate, but sure enough, there was one in the northern jungle. No need to thank me. Now I'll just let you deal with, uh, your problem. Uh, we've got something to do. Yeah, have fun. So, Pikachu, I just, I wanted to thank you earlier. I know maybe you were under stress, but maybe now we can, you know, talk. Evie, I just, it's really no big deal. I mean, no problem. Come on! Just talk to me! Next is Team Lake. If you guys manage to top 660 points, you guys win. However, if you score below 330 points, you'll be eliminating one of your own. Don't worry, we'll be fine. No berries. Well, with your advantage from the last challenge, you managed to earn 100 points. Team Lake. You lose by quite a lot, which means that Team Jungle wins this challenge and earns the prize. Team Lake, one of you is leaving tonight. We only lost because Purloin tried to trick us and tear us apart. She kept trying to poison us or lead us to the wrong place. All I know is that she is going to be eliminated tonight. Too bad, so sad. Oh well, her fault, not mine. That villain goes home tonight. See you at the elimination team. That bitch will get what's coming to her. Yes, she will. Wait, we vote for Roselia, right? Hells yes! Roselia is literally the worst. She's lazy, stupid, loud, annoying, and just the worst teammate. Plus, I can't go another day listening to her complain. That's my job, sister. Also, she's fat as fuck. You have all voted for which teammate will be the first to leave. If you receive one of these safari balls, you are safe and will remain for another week. The first three balls go to... Gotharita, Beautiful Eye, and Clefairy. Porloin, your teammates call you a villain. Roselia, you failed to get any berries for your team and blamed everyone else for your mistakes. So the final safari ball goes to... By a vote of one to four... Purloin. Are you kidding me? Why would you leave this satanic creature? Roselia, you're basically the worst. All you do is complain and yell. Are you joking? Uh, you all are the worst! Roselia, I'm, I'm sorry, but maybe you can learn from this? Don't you dare and try to manipulate me. Watch out for Purloin. She's gonna run this team into the ground. I'm glad Roselia is finally gone. But I still need to make sure I'm helpful. I may actually be able to win my teammates over and no longer be seen as the villain. I'm not manipulating anybody. I just want friends. Hey, Dwebble. Hope I didn't wake you up. Oh, hey, Staravia. What's up? I just really need to thank you for what you did today. You saved me from possible elimination. I appreciate it. No big deal. I'd do anything for a friend. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Friends? I, I, I don't know what to say. I'm happy, and yet, I'm not. Maybe I'm being a little ridiculous, but I don't think I want to be friends with Dwebble. 
I think I want to be more.